So today I just woke up dumb confused thinking it was a Friday because with the content that dropped today, no chance it was a Tuesday, but turns out it is. And in fact, it's probably the most hype player they've dropped on a Tuesday in recent memory. That's a guy that's currently cooking in the playoffs. 99 overall, dark matter hero, Wardell Stephen Curry. And what's crazy about this card is if you're a Stefan, you're gonna be able to get your hands on this card very easy because like I said, it was a Tuesday drop where the odds were very increased in getting these dark matters so i wouldn't be surprised if this card right now is already a buy now price now he also did get an invincible card that dropped today unfortunately i couldn't pull him in packs and he's still going for a ton of mt that i'm not gonna be able to get him for a while but if you guys want to see the invincible as well 2500 likes on this video tells me i should go ahead and buy him but today man we're here to play around with the greatest shooter of all time who again i'm very surprised we got on a tuesday but here he is with a new and improved version of his dark matter let's take a look man so 99 offense 99 defense standing at six foot three which obviously is going to be a bit of a problem at this point in the year when everyone's a giant but you might still be able to get it done man 98 driving layup 99 three-pointer and mid-range 98 free throw 80 driving dunk can definitely work with that insane ball handling and passing i love the defense interior definitely isn't the prettiest and neither is the block but the perimeter and steel hopefully can get the job done 98 speed down the line 95 vertical 97 lateral quickness not too hot on the 79 strength there but hopefully he doesn't get cooked too badly man we go all the way down on the tendencies and they're not too shabby 97 on ball and pass 85 shot contest and block i honestly thought they juice it up just a little bit more because he's standing at six foot three at the end of the day but i guess it is what it is man he does come with a total of 33 hall of famers and 29 gold versus the invincible that's got 65 hall of famers and like six gold but we got important badges like the catch and shoot corner specialist fearless finisher hyperdrive dimer me mama the pickpocket clamps quick chain interceptor i can already see that he does not have the hall of fame brick wall the hall of fame intimidator which again comes as a surprise given that he's such a small card at this point in the year you want to give people a reason to pick this card up but you got the no-brainer stuff like the blinders circus threes limitless spot up and chef curry is gonna have a hall of fame chef downhill handles for days quick for step clutch shooter dead eye sniper stop pop green machine i mean the list goes on as far as the offensive badges what worries me about this card is what he's going to be able to do on the defensive end you do have the gold intimidator which i guess is better than nothing but still got the posterizer my question is what badges is he missing that i would throw on right away number one it's gonna be the brick wall rim protector is another big must for him box doesn't hurt to throw on you're gonna need post lockdown and aside from that everything else is kind of whatever limitless takeoff will definitely help with the fact that he's only got an 80 driving dunk but uh i'm not gonna lie i'm slightly disappointed in how they did my boy on the defensive end because offense has never really been a problem for curry and my team it's always him getting mashed and stuff like that but is this card going to be worth picking up or should you upgrade to what is likely going to be a very expensive invincible card only one way to find out man let's hop into a game and let's see what the light skin assassin can do for us today let's get into it all right ladies and gentlemen welcome back to another htb gameplay steph curry versus the 6 7 Lamelo ball i know what i want off the bat and that's gonna be a screen look at that the fact that we got that curry slide back. Yeah. cross over lamello's lost moving yeah. shot oh my goodness, oh my goodness. So one thing I didn't mention about Curry is you're going to want to surround him with size. Right there, LaMelo Ball plays next to no defense, but on the defensive end, he's going to get dogged on screen. So at least having someone at the shooting guard spot that can hold it down. That new Siakam is a good example. Scottie Pippen, even this RJ isn't too bad. Get there, Shaq. Way to play defense. I'm glad they're not blowing that whistle for shots today, man. Let's go. I do like how the Curry side wasn't just given to anybody this year. I can just use it right there. Look at that. Easy blow by. Get the ball inside. One more swing to the corner. King Dirk. Go ahead and give me all three of those, man. Offensively, Curry's going to be fine. The only concern is the defense. So one thing I decided to do is switch Curry onto Vince Carter instead of LaMelo. Just because LaMelo, you know, he's a little bit taller than Vince. But look at that. He's holding it down. He's trying to fight through all these screens. And Curry is holding his own. These are the things you love to show off. The defensive possessions. Hold it down, Big Diesel. Yes, sir. Come on. We play defense for all 24 seconds of that shot clock, man. Let's get up the court. I low-key can throw an alley-oop here to Shaq if I get the right screen. Hit that. Thank you. Yes, sir. Oh, that's an oop for the Big Diesel. Ugh. Let me 
get that screen, man. Ezzy, he's gonna go into that screen every time, man. Snatch back, cross him over, thank you. Curry side, I thought I had the space there. Get the ball to Giannis. They're giving him too much room right there. Shaq, one more swing. RJ, bang. Hold your own there, Diesel. Yes, sir, we not getting dunked on. Definitely not in this house. Advance the ball ASAP. Oh, yeah, I see Curry stopping. Want to pop that. RJ gets way too much room, and we're moving that ball around. Yeah, we there. We there, let him pass that ball inside. Good defense there by Giannis. Diesel, we going all the way? Nah, Dirk, get a little flashy for us. And one! I'm surprised they didn't let me go all the way through with the dunk. Give me a stop here. Yes! Oh my god, we sent that into the freaking moon. Lil Hezzy, he's gonna foul right there. And we got some free throws here to end off the quarter. Wardell's only got six points, but we all know when it comes to the Warriors, it's always that third quarter where, where they go crazy. But in this case, next quarter, we're going stupid. In the second quarter, they're definitely trying to exploit Curry on defense, but that's okay. A little crossover, thank you. Curry side, too much space there for Wardell! Man, it's nice having the Curry slide specific for Curry. I know more cards are probably gonna get it as the year goes, but I'm glad they didn't just throw it on anyone like they did last year. So this guy's caught on to the fact that Steph is by far the worst defender on my team. Luckily, he's making it up on offense, but yeah, he's getting dogged on the pick and rolls right now, I can't lie. Thank you, Curry side. Oh, yeah, stopping. That's an easy mid-range. Beautiful pull up there by Curry, and that's going down. We have takeover now. All I need is a couple stops, man. He's going to be looking for a screen. Get ready for that drop there by Wiseman. We're watching all of that. Good defense there, RJ. That's what you love to see, baby. Curry in the corner. Divers. Bang. I got to use more of Curry's bag because he's got a step back. He's got a moving three. That's nasty. Curry side out of that. Thank you. See you later. And get the ball inside. Beautiful ball movement. And that's a dunk. Give me that. Oh, I thought we had that. Never mind. RJ is nuts on defense, bro. It really is crazy how good that card is. Pump pick. I thought he jumped. Cross him up. Thank you. Where are you going, Wiseman? I know we're teammates, but you ain't got to show me that much space. In the second half here with Kobe and the crew, Wardell getting open for a three, and of course, it's going to be Splash. He's got 25 points. I've loved what he's been doing tonight. Again, defensively, it's a struggle, but if you can hide him correctly like I am right now, you're going to be fine. He's going to make that pass inside at some point. Throw it. Throw it. Oh, I thought he would miss. Ralph ain't got it like that. Yes, he do. I'm dumb. Pick and fade. Thank you. See you later. Yes, sir. All the way to the basket. First driving dunk there for Steph, and it's going down, man. All right, Pippen, lock it up. All he's doing is hunting that switch. Pass it inside. Oh, how is that not a steal? It's in Porzingis' hand. I mean, I get wanting to keep this game close, but sheesh, man. He's going to go into every single screen. Porzingis, I need you on that roll. Is he in the air? Yes, he is. That's an easy bucket. Come on, man. Hit a screen hard enough, and I'm going for a moving three. Thank you. Never mind. Get the ball inside. They're switching that right away. They really don't want me to shoot. All right, man. I see how we moving. Low behind the back. Thank you. Cross it up. Oh, poor Zingas wide open. Nice little pick and pop. Way to get open right away, man. He can hit as many twos as he wants in the paint. We're going to answer with threes. They're starting to make a run, so I got to go off with somebody else that's not Curry for now. Try to crab him. Too much space there for the Mamba. How is that even contested? Thank you, man. The man was nowhere near me. Good defense. Good defense. Good defense. Get there. Good defense by Curry. All right, so we close out the third quarter there. It's a seven-point game. I'm going to get the starters back in here, and we're going to close this thing out, man. Give me that. Thank you. That pick-and-roll BS is only going to work for so long, my friend. I'm telling you right now. Pump fake. Curry. Open for three. Bang! Come on, boys. Let's keep pushing the pace. Go to RJ. Then go to Curry. Come on. Keep going baseline. Come Moving on. three. Yes, sir! See, now Steph's in his bag, man. He's woken up. Dirk is getting so much space there. A little crossover. Thank you. See you later. Little driving dunk action. He's got 35 points. Come on. We're going here, Steph. Finesse that. Hit that. Oh, you're on my side. See you later. Adios. <laughs> Start doing them celebrations, Wardell. Lock it up, Curry. Yes, sir. He's going to have to pass the ball. Nah, watch that moving shot. We're there for the contest. Come on now. Kick that ball out in transition. Catch. Pump fake. He's jumping at that for sure. Curry. Back. Oh, that would have been so nasty. Snatch back. See you later, LaMelo. Oh, yeah, right to the basket. Pump fake. Pump fake. Hey, Shaq, can we please get out of the paint? Can we please get out of the paint? I'm trying to get a bucket for myself. <laughs> Thank you. All right, man. So the greatest shooter of all time. He came to play today. 20 minutes. He had 40 points, two rebounds, 10 assists, and only two turnovers. Great assist to turnover ratio right there. Had two steals as well. Loved what my team was doing on the defensive end. Shaquille O'Neal and RJ 
they didn't miss a shot. Curry was 14 for 26, but obviously, you're gonna get a little trigger happy towards the end of the game. When it comes to a Wardell card, man, you wanna try to hit one crazy shot. Unfortunately, I couldn't. He did have a couple free throws, though. Gave us a couple dunks this game. Made me feel confident when I was going to the basket because they weren't really blockable dunk animations. They were basic and they were quick, and that's what you love to see out of a card like this. Now, I will say this. I think the invincible Steph Curry is gonna end up being a big difference from the hero. Out of all the invincible hero combos that we've gotten, the Giannis, the Kobe, Steph Curry is gonna feel the most different with the invincible than he will with a hero. And I haven't even had my hands on the invincible one yet, and this is why. 65 Hall of Fame badges, a ton of those are gonna be defensive. He'll have 99 interior, 99 block. I mean, the biggest difference between this Curry and the other Curry is just the fact that you're gonna feel a lot more confident on the defensive end. His strength, his interior defense, and his block are all concerning stats at this point in the year, especially because you're gonna be up against Giants for the most part. Now, when I think about it, it makes sense why they made the hero Curry just kind of what he is, because if they give him interior defense, most people wouldn't need to go out there and get the invincible version, which is what I think this Curry is gonna try to push. So I think they made his weaknesses very obvious. Now, at the end of the day, man, this Curry is still a bucket. Offensively, you are not gonna struggle with this Curry. Card. It's defensively that you're gonna have to figure out how to hide him from Giannis, Ben Simmons, Kirilenko. I mean, people can run any sort of Giants, and if you run into a five-man Giant team, you're gonna get pick and roll to death with Mr. Steph here. Figure out your defense if you're gonna run a guy like this. Make sure you've got a very good defensive player at the two. But all around, man, he's a fun card. If you're a Steph fan, you're gonna have nothing but fun with him. You're gonna struggle on defense, like I said before, but he's a very cool card, man. That's gonna do it for today, though. If y'all wanna see the Invincible, if y'all wanna see me spend the big cash moolah, I gotta see that like button get smashed. I appreciate you guys, as always. Subscribe if you're new on that grind to 400K. Thank you for watching, and take care.